Four years ago, when I made the decision to leave behind the traditional path and not follow the status quo that was telling me to get an engineering degree and get a soul-sucking job for the rest of my existence, I followed, studied, and analyzed hundreds of personalities and mentors that inspired me who had taken that narrow road towards their dreams, had taken the leap towards chasing their goals and made a small dent in the universe. They all agreed on the importance of hard work, sacrifice, consistency. These are things that they all had in common. But what surprised me most wasn't that. What surprised me most is that they all shared one single thing common. They were attacked by society for their beliefs, actions, and message. Socrates was sentenced to death for corrupting the youth. Jesus was crucified after being betrayed by Judas. And this guy right here served 27 years in prison. These are obviously bigger than life personalities that changed the trajectory of history. And by no means am I comparing myself to them. But for some reason, even though I read and I listened to these mentors and personalities talk about the attacks that they suffered, the clueless 17 year old version of me thought that I'd never get to the point where I suffer attacks. Today, I wanted to share a message that I've been thinking about for months. A message that's simply not spoken about enough in the space of success and online business and making money. First of all, I want to let you know that nothing is easy, but nothing is impossible. This video is not to discourage you from chasing your passions, your dreams, your hopes of taking care of your loved ones and designing the life that you want to live. If I've done it, I have absolutely no doubt in my mind that you can do. But it would be hypocritical of me to sit down on this desk every single week come on and talk about the ways you can make money and have success online without sharing the truth about the success that we all seem to desire so much. Aside which you must consider to decide whether success for you is worth it or not. Look, success comes with fulfillment, but it also comes with sacrifice. It comes with accolades, yes, but it also comes with solitude. It comes with praise, but it also comes with people doubting you and misunderstanding you. It comes with a very rewarding inner transformation, but it also comes with nerve and fears of whether this whole thing will work out. Which managed properly, it can make you grow more than ever, but if managed poorly, it can literally take you down. And more importantly, it comes with envy from others which seems hard to wrap my head around. Since I was a kid, I've studied and admired the greats of this civilization to inspire me and motivate me to become a better me, to achieve my potential. But I never once felt envy. I looked at them with all their gifts and faults, hoping that one day I could be as free and as impactful as them. Today, I'm incredibly grateful that I've impacted millions of people through my content. And to this day, I sometimes feel the solitude of sacrifice and success. And to this day, I suffer attacks because of envy and jealousy. I'd be lying to you if I told you that this side of success doesn't hurt. It surely does. But unfortunately, it's part of the game. There will always be people who try to build something by tearing others down. However, my mission and vision are simply bigger than myself to let them be affected by an attack on my persona. You watching this video, you wanting to achieve your dreams. You must, I repeat, you must be ready to receive attacks from people who are not capable of achieving theirs and thus awaken their hate towards you. <laughs> I picture them in their room, unhappy, letting out their rage and helplessness through the coldness of a computer screen. What they don't seem to understand is that if they spend that time they're spending on attacking us, if they, if they literally spent half of that time on their dreams and aspirations, they too could achieve them. But that seems too far to grasp for the frequency at which they operate. Instead, they choose to live in scarcity, lies, and inauthenticity. They choose to operate out of hate. And instead of us, the human race, working together to impact the world at a larger scale, they choose to tear others down for their own selfish needs. A little bit more money, a little bit more views, a little bit of fame. For the past four years, I've scaled my social media marketing agency to seven figures, working with some of the biggest clients in the space like Clean Beauty, an agency that I still actively run to this day. I've also put my own money down using my marketing skills, using my agency team, and I've created my own econ brands like Dr. Planus Cosmetica, which we've taken to seven figures. And I've documented the whole thing on my TikTok, my YouTube, my Instagram stories, and my Instagram feed. And by doing so, putting forth a concept the Monopoly Ecom Agency concept, which I've turned into the agency coaching program, not with the most students, that's not really the metric of success that we're guided by, but with the highest success rate per student in the entire industry, quality over quantity. We've had people that have been lost and led astray, believe in themselves again and finally make this opportunity work. We've brought them light in their paths, allow them to quit university, their soul sucking nine to five job, take their agency to a whole new level and design the life of their dreams. I focus on the results of my students because their results are also the results of me and the team. A team that is made up of people that have actually been through the program, have scaled their own widely successful agency and chose to believe in the mission. Together, we're stronger. Together, we reach our goals. And when money no longer brings any joy or fulfillment personally, nothing feels better than sending the elevator down tapping into your God-given talent and sharing what's changed your life with others. No point in taking what I've learned through my sweat, blood, and tears to the grave. One-to-one personal mentorship, guidance, shadowing, that's how we move forward as a civilization. But obviously, to get to where me, my students, and my team get to, I insist you will need to act in abundance. Choose light over the darkness that exists in those that tear others down. Choose to add value to the world instead of hate. Choose sacrifice and commit to becoming exceptional. And understand that whether it's at a small scale, family, friends, community, or at a larger scale, these negative energy driven beings 
and society will try to tear you down. And would you really expect any difference if you're trying to make a small dent in the universe? As I mentioned earlier in the video, the human race has been doing this for thousands of years and social media has only amplified this. The only thing you can do is know your truth have your clients, your students, your people know your truth, live in complete authenticity, have the right support network, surround yourself with good people and operate out of love. And it goes without saying, but I guess I have to say it because it seems like there's still people that believe this from some marketing messages that are pushed down in the space. My mentorship isn't a magic pill that you can just take and have success overnight, but it surely gets results, heaps of good results. For those who can put their emotions aside, focus on the work, put their ego in check and be willing to learn. And, and ultimately for those who know how to take advantage of opportunities. For those who are not at that frequency and don't want to be helped, especially those who haven't been a client of mine or actually gone through the mentorship, they will become bitter and criticize the dreams of others. Choosing to follow the narrow path and deviate from the status quo has been without a doubt one of the best decisions of my life. My team, my family, my friends, my clients and students, and you, my community, are my core pillars. And aside from the money, the accolades, the lifestyle, all that stuff, you know what brings me the most joy and what I generally see as the true definition of success? Hitting the pillow at night, knowing that I've done my best, I'm changing lives, and I'm surrounded by the people that I love. And waking up every morning, look at myself in the mirror, and be proud of the person I'm becoming. Take my audience away, take my apartment away, take my car away, take all the material stuff, the money, all that stuff, come hell high water, no one can take that away from me. That inner transformation, the fulfillment, the love from the people that I truly care about and my clients and students, no one will be able to take that away from me. And that's why I love this game, baby.